the on forever Trojan basically creates a file named 000001.com and this .com file has instructions to create a file named 00002.com and that one creates 0003.com etc they all execute each other and this eventually leads to on forever filling up the drive which it's attacking so let's go ahead and run it you'll see it running every new file that it creates here so you can see it's creating all of these different files on the drive eventually it will fill up the drive at number 503 now if we give a dir command you'll see that there's tons of these files and thank god it's relatively easy to delete these on DOS and now the Trojan's gone and that's about it for the on forever Trojan